Michael. Uh, I've brought in a symbolic nipple. Here is your <laughs> symbolic nipple. Uh, this is because I've got an oral fixation. Pop psychology-wise would, would suggest that this, this began with, with, with the nipple. Unless I'm very, very, very heavily distracted, uh, I, I either ha have something in my mouth or I'm thinking about what I could put in my mouth. <laughs> Be it food, drink, nicotine, gum, pens. Are you thinking of something right now to put in your mouth? I am, yeah. What do you want to put in your mouth now? I want to put in something minty. <laughs> <laughs> so if I put my... If I walk past you with my thumb like this, you'd I'll be, be on it. it. I'll be on it, I guess. Yeah, OK. Like a rat up a kilt. <laughs> <laughs> and all that quaint old Scottish saying. <laughs> Fart. Fartest wins. Your time starts now. Not a lot going on at the moment. Have you, have you tried yet? At the moment, there's no... no gas in the tank, <laughs> so to speak. Is there any way of putting gas in the tank? Well, I wonder. There was a guy at primary school, I think he used to have various brewing positions he used to swear by. There are a lot of them involved sort of... sort of... kind of... Sort of positioning yourself like this, and so on. Because maybe there wasn't the gas in the... Let's see if we can encourage it to go the other way. <laughs> And massage the inner, the inner mic. I didn't know you could do this. Sort of Neither thing. did I. I'm going to leave you to it for the moment. You carry on. Yeah. We're now in a different season. We are now one and a half hours into Mike's attempt. The crew had gone to lunch. Hello. The plane has been booked by someone else now. You have to leave the plane. Fair play. I feel ashamed. Sorry. Still time. I'll keep working on it. Never has a nation been so gripped by one man's battle with his bowels. <laughs> will he succeed? Is this what will make Mike Wozniak a household name? Will his efforts bring our broken nation back together? Only time will tell. You can go and clean yourself up if you want. Thanks, Alex. Any, nothing else you able to do at this stage? Well, in fact, I mean, I, maybe if I have a moment... It could... it could... it could... It could, it could be that something happens. I mean, it must be possible, right? It all changed. It all changed. It was like some real effort. <laughs> well, that was a tiny, 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 tiny little pop. Oh, stop the clock. Wow. Not very satisfying. Yeah, quite a long wait for that. And I think I probably need to check myself. Anyway, so I'll, <laughs> I'll see you later. <laughs> <It's awful. laughs> Please tell me you put a sound effect on it. Is that the genuine that, noise? That's the genuine noise. That's <laughs> the, it's one of the worst things I've ever heard in my life. I can talk you through what I think happened, if you want. It's well, not, I, it's not I, pleasant. I, I don't need you to, cos you've clearly shut yourself. <laughs> <laughs> that's what I thought. But there was the passage of air, so I had... Like, the flatus had gone through. Task, tick. What, it, what in fact, I had done is I would uh, dislodged a uh, haemorrhoid that had been... You know, oh, for quite God. a long time. Oh, that's, God. that's what you're hearing. Oh, God. You're hearing that moving through my anal canal. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, that's a hemorrhoid popping out. And back out into the outside in full bloom. <laughs> it's still flapping about to this day. You, it's still loose. Oh, it's an absolute casserole down there. <laughs> But you get a task, you do the task. <laughs> no matter the price. Oh, my God. That's a great when he does it. You must have been aware something had come out, but you still were so happy that you'd achieved the task. His little face. <laughs> Just have a look at his little face. Let's have a look. <laughs> it's so counterintuitive, isn't it? Because in any other situation, you'd go, I hope no one heard that. <laughs> and it's the complete opposite. Did you get it? <laughs> <laughs> um, Greg, do you want to give him a 
point at all. Gee, we've got to give him something. I mean, his family aren't staying around after that. <laughs> No-one's going to begrudge him a bonus point. How many oh, are we giving no. him? Just one. One, OK. Yeah. Yeah, one, one for hemorrhoid, I suppose. OK, so one hemorrhoid and one point to yeah. Mike Wozniak. Yeah. Yeah. The thing I can carry, but only just is, is a tune. Oh. 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 So now, okay. this, this duvet and potato yeah. boy, <laughs> <laughs> this is lateral thinking. <laughs> okay, well, here's the CD on the screen. This is what the winner is going to get. Mike has provided the backing track, which I will play now. Facts about animals, prawns are cannibals. If there's an elephant in the room, then you're in the wrong room. Cutting an earthworm in half makes you a sadist. I think it's worth repeating that prawns eat their babies and monkeys eat monkeys, but who gives them monkeys? Monkeys. And if you squash a wasp, it releases a chemical from the wasp that attracts people who tell you facts about wasps. <laughs> You're a really good singer. I don't know, Sarah. It sounded fairly awful. Really? <laughs> and it was a sort of nightmarish <laughs> vision of nature. They're absolute wrong uns, uh, prawns. I'm just writing down prawns are wrong uns, and we'll yeah. move on. Most pints of milk drunk per month. We asked all of you before the show to state oh, how many pints of milk per month thing. you drink. If you think that you drink the most, hold up number one. I don't know this about you, Mike, but I got instinct tells me you guzzle the stuff. <laughs> I'm an absolute bloody milk guzzler. <laughs> <laughs> Cover your lower half in biodegradable cling film. And gaffer tape so that no part of your lower half isn't covered in biodegradable cling film and gaffer tape. Can I just use one? Oh, it's and. Your time starts now. The slight concern is the phrasing. Literally every bit of me in cling film and also literally every bit of me in gaffer tape. That's my concern. Does it have to be in equal proportions? All the information is on the task. <laughs> oh, it's not pleasant. I genuinely feel like I've done this before. <laughs> oh, the... oh, you see, that's the problem, isn't it? What's that? Because I can't get down to the bottom now. Uh, I've never been especially bendy. In the absence of bendiness, I need to do something else. Oh, curses. Under we go. <laughs> okay. Uh, okay. Oh God, it's not too far, is it? I feel like a mermaid. There we go then. No. <laughs> oh no. Put on the captain's hat. Put on the captain's hat. Your lower half must be completely covered in biodegradable cling film and tape when you're wearing the captain's hat. Fastest twinge your time starts now. Captain's hat. <laughs> I've stopped the clock. It's not in that plane, is it? I feel like, I presumed it was on the plane. It is on the plane. Oh, there it is. Inside the plane? No. Is it on the plane? It's on the plane. Oh, there it is. Can you do a 360 spin? I'll try. Shut it up. Grab the marshmallow with your tongs. When the taskmaster says play, you have 10 seconds to grab the marshmallow. Once your tongs are over the table, you must attempt to grab the marshmallow. If you successfully grab the marshmallow, you win. So that's what one team will do. The other team will do this. Bat away the marshmallow. When the taskmaster says play, you will have 10 seconds to bat away the marshmallow. Your hands may not be over the table until the other player's tongs are over the table. If your hand is over the table first, you are disqualified from the round. If you bat away the marshmallow, you win. It's a game of slaps, but with tongs and a marshmallow. There are going to be six battles. If someone in your team wins, that is one point for everyone in your team. Three, two, one. Slap and tongs. Great. 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 That's another activity that Mike Wozniak's clearly done yeah. before. <laughs> Just when I thought he couldn't look more like a praying mantis. <laughs> <laughs> Make that balloon hover untethered for 20 seconds. What balloon? During the hovering, the top of the balloon must not be higher than your chin 
and the bottom of the balloon must not be lower than your waist. Also, you must sneer throughout the 20 seconds. Fastest wins, your time starts now. All right. Will you excuse me a minute? All right, so I'm just trying to make it sort of uh, a little weight. It's not tethered. OK, let's go. Sneering. <laughs> oh, you little... I don't think that was 20 seconds. Uh, one of your little uh, laundry pegs is on that. I'm still sneering. I think, arguably, that's a lost cause. All right, then. Oh. Oh. <laughs> ah. There you are. Put your balloon back. One sneery, sneery. Two sneery, sneery. Twenty sneery sneery. Well, thank you. I'm very happy I got your balloon back, Alex. When you uh, lose uh, lose that, in case you need it. Thanks. Thank you, Mike. Many evening victory. When you stepped out of that phone booth, you looked like the head of department from a local council. <laughs> You've just been fired. <laughs> Talk us through the initial sort of Greek dance. Greek technique. dance? The... <laughs> it's, it's hovering over a certain area, so I'm trying to sort of keep my described area in the right sort of zone. Yeah. And I... It wasn't an intent... This just... It just <laughs> this is not really a plan, it's just... I enjoyed your balloon dance. Thank you. And then up it went. And then up it went. And this is where it gets interesting, because the two other contestants whose balloon flew away just let them go. <laughs> but not Mike Wozniak. Never let it go. That spirit of the blitz mentality. <laughs> That's right. No one has ever hopped over that fence before. We've never, never had a fence hop. How do you feel about that? I felt good, and I was thrilled when I got over the other side that it was just earth on the other... It was really sort of about halfway through the job that I didn't really know it was on the bottom. <laughs> it could have been a mine shaft. That would be one hell of an ending to the <laughs> 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 <Incredible. laughs> For more Taskmaster, subscribe now. <laughs> <laughs>